hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's a girl all and in today's video i'll be sharing with you how i made this delicious fluffy banana bread with oreos as toppings the last one i made i made with chocolate flakes as toppings and today i'll be sharing with you how i use oreos so for my ingredients these are my ingredients to make my banana bread we have vanilla extract we have the oreos biscuit baking soda we have the cinnamon powder we have melted butter we have brown sugar we have white sugar here we have flour we have three eggs three ripe bananas and we have milk so in a clean bowl you add your bananas and you mash them you can use a fork to do that or you can use this hand mixer to do that then after mashing down note you don't want to over mash or over mix your butter when making banana bread you add your melted butter and also you add your eggs to the butter and you mix together when making banana bread you have to mix properly but don't over mix your butter so after mixing you go ahead to add your white sugar and your brown sugar you mix together and after mixing your white sugar and brown sugar together you add your milk this is me measuring my milk all the measurements will be listed under the description below after adding the milk you mix properly but don't over mix as usual and after mixing then you go ahead to sieve your flour you use your all-purpose flour and you sieve your flour the reason for sieving the flour is to remove any extra lumps then you add your cinnamon powder vanilla extract your baking soda and you mix properly all the measurements will be listed in the description shown below so you can check it out in the description so after mixing everything do not over mix it we are mixing gently i'm not using force to mix this because it's banana bread and you don't want it to be over mixed so after mixing properly then you proceed to prepping your oreos biscuits so i just crushed some few oreos and i added to the butter and i mixed together after adding the oreos biscuits i set aside and bring my baking pan i prep my baking pan with my baking paper so that it can easily bake through and also it will be easy to come out without staining my pan so i pour my butter inside my baking pan and after pouring that i eat it so that everything can actually spread around then i added two more oreos biscuit as toppings and this is how the pattern look very thick and very delicious then i set aside inside the preheated oven and cover for it to bake so for the oven i set my oven at 45 minutes to 20 degrees and after baking for 20 minutes i check my butter to see if it's well well baked and for you to dip a still wear inside the banana bread and if it comes out soggy that means it's remaining need to bake more so i cover and at this point i reduce my degrees to 150 degrees and i like bake for the remaining 25 minutes and this is how my banana bread looks very delicious and very very yummy so i set aside and allow it to cool down for 10 to 15 minutes before bringing out from the pan and this is how it looks after 10 to 15 minutes i had to bring it out from the pan it's very easy to bring out from the baking pan when you use baking paper and it will not allow your baking pan to be stained or anything and removed it from the baking paper as you can see it's very yummy no bones and i placed it on top of my plate and i get ready for cutting but before i cut this beauty just take a moment to look how beautiful this banana bread looks because once i cut it no going back to this beauty so this is how the banana bread looks very beautiful very yummy and very delicious so i went ahead to cut the banana bread them into some slice and you this is how fluffy it is can you see guys it's very fluffy very delicious and very yummy yeah this is how my banana bread looks and yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video let me know if you'll be trying out this recipe under the comment section and please like share and please comment on my youtube channel and if you've not subscribed please hit the subscribe button and subscribe let's go together if you have any question you can let me know under the comment section and thank you bye bye